Yes, the government can control the weather a little bit. Cloud seeding is not a new technology. It was invented in 1946. The way it works is simple. In nature, every single raindrop has a little bit of dirt at the center of it. As a matter of fact, if our atmosphere was perfectly clean, we would not have any clouds or rain at all. So someone had the brilliant idea. Well, what if we dumped more particulate into the clouds? Wouldn't that give the water like more places to hold on to, which would make more raindrop? The stuff they drop is not even that special. Sometimes it's just salt or dry ice. Pretty much every country has experimented with cloud seeding. China famously does it before big events to try to get the clouds to like drop their rain before hitting the event. And we've tried to use it for more nefarious purposes as well. During the Vietnam War, during Operation Popeye, the US tried to basically flood out the North Vietnamese troops and make their supply routes more challenging. There's just one problem with all this. It just doesn't work that well. We have 80 years of research on cloud seeding at this point, and it's not hard to do. Like you or me could go up in a plane and just take a bunch of salt or whatever and try it out for ourselves. But at best, it has like a 10 to 30% impact and some scientists think it does nothing at all. But it's not a conspiracy. It exists in the private sector as well. This is a company you can call and have them come, you know, do some cloud seeding above your farm or whatever. So why haven't you heard more about this stuff? Because it just doesn't work that well, basically.